Hey everyone, and welcome to or welcome back to Norris Cove. I'm Yoshida, and if today is your first time here, here at the Cove, we do budgeting, cash stuffing sometimes, and I like to just kind of plan my life out a little bit. So I do a little bit of minimal or functional planning. So if that sounds like something can, something that you are interested in, I hope that you would consider subscribing and sticking around for more content for myself. Um, but today we're going to be doing my weekly budget. I am a little bit um, behind. I've been working on Etsy orders and regular shop orders. Pretty much all budget items that you see here um if you are new here they are in my shop um most of the them are linked below the paycheck to paycheck or paycheck budget which we're going to do today so let's see this was last week um i didn't put my totals in let's see i think we came out with 1209 I'm going to do a flip of my new A5, y'all. I done jumped into A5, and I love it. Um, let's see. Yeah. Oh, we did 1,000. This is the week of the 5th. Yes. Let me get a pen here. I call myself being prepared, so I don't have to take long today. But we ended up doing in here 1,000. $194.35 for last week. And we have down here Etsy 100, um, Norse Code 448. And yeah, so, and I guesstimated 400. So yeah, we're doing good. And looking at this week, I think we're going to do about maybe nine. We've already done uh, about 300. So, let's skip on over to this week. Um, but, yeah, let's review this real quick. So, sorry. So, we did State Farm. I paid out, like, $900 within a whole week to them. But last week's payment was $443. Cloth and paper got paid. Amazon. All these are checked. Man, my booth rent got paid. Um, community. Victoria's Secrets. Walmart. Credit One. Booth rent. Afterpay. Um, Etsy, another Afterpay, and T-Mobile. Um, I need to fill this in um, here. I bought some products for the shop. That's what's down here blanked out. I'm glad I remember to blank that out. So we're just going to hop on into this week. So for this week, we're going to put down our main source, which is hair. Um, I said 900 Norris Cove, which is my Shopify stationer. If you're new here, um, I got some money this week from there. I'm going to put 150 I think it was like 130 And then I'm doing nails this week. That reminds me, I need to text the client back. I'm just going to put 40 and then we'll do that later. So bills due this week. You guys filled out my monthly with me. So we should be able to jump here and see what we got. Let's see. Um, this is the 6th through the 12th. My goodness. We are moving. Okay. So first thing I know I have is Canva that came out. And that was $13.77. That has come out. Oh, I did give T-Mobile a hundred on Monday the 6th. Uh, what else we got? Y'all, I paid a lot of stuff this week. I got products for the budget box, for the shop. <sighs> Boy, I spent, I got to go down here to... Let me jump down here to expenses because I spent about 70 on hair products for the salon. I'm just putting that in there so I don't forget. Um, gas. I keep doing something stupid. I keep calling myself trying to get to Sam so I can get the cheap gas. But it's far from me. So I'll put $20 in hoping I can get to the gas. And I never do. So when I finally make it to a gas station, I got to pay just way too much. So $80 already. 
and gain. So that just doesn't make sense. So I need to figure that out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, let's see. And then we have Chase on the 11th. And I think they're, I put down 98 in my budget, but I think they're about 100. And then on the 11th as well, we have Booth Rent. Now, here's what's going on, you guys. I have to have surgery next Friday. And I just realized, see, and I looked at my planner when I was making this appointment. It's just the in and out surgery, but I can't work Saturday or Sunday. But the surgeon said I should be able to go back on Monday. Well, this is when subs go out. So, I'm hopefully going to be able to send out subs on Monday. Let me see. Um, I used the brown. So, I'm going to try to still be packing stuff um, to get the subs out. But, I just happened to think about that. So, that's going to kind of mess with my income a little bit. Because I have to be on Friday for the surgery. And then Saturday, I normally work. And, you know, I'm not that busy. But still, I need my coins. <clears throat> so I'm going to extend my shipping time. Oh, that was a perfect cut. I'm going to extend my shipping time to Monday. And hopefully I can work Saturday. That is really going to mess up my budget, but I can't prolong it anymore. It's just an in and out surgery. So I need to really save this week because I have my car note due next week, which is actually Wednesday. <sighs> and then I have uplift. So I'm going to try to take care of uplift out of this week as well. And I think this is my last payment. And it's $38.57. Okay, so let's do a little totaling of what I'm going to make. I've already spent boo coo money. Like, I got an oil change today. Matter of fact, let me write that down in the notes. And that, and got a tire rotation. So that was 100 and $38. So if I'm going looking like where's my money, I like to make little notes because <clears throat> I don't always make it to my spending tracker. So let's see what we have. We have 1090 Um, I may get some money from Etsy. Not sure. Um, I think... I make money from Etsy this week too. So let me put down here, Miss. Let me put Etsy. Because I'm like, this money ain't going to make no sense later. So plus 100 from Etsy. That's uh, 1,190. I'm going to put that down here in the total income. And let's add up our bills. Five hundred and two dollars and thirty four cents. That don't even make any sense. Like I feel like I owe more. So we're gonna subtract that from the one thousand one hundred and ninety. So it leaves six eighty seven sixty six. Like that would be perfect. Um, for my car note. Let me slide this up. Five oh two. 34 and then I'm going to subtract 150 which is the total of my hair products and gas oh god let me add it so at least 537 66 Total expenses, 150. Um, we're not doing any sinking funds. I kind of wanted to. Um, I actually need to 
send some money to my high yield savings. I read watch the video I did and I said I'd give about ten dollars a month. I try to do ten dollars a week, not ten dollars a month. So I gotta send my little regular ten dollar <laughs> payment to my high yield savings. So um let me put that over here. And I budget ten, but I'm thinking about sending twenty. So we'll see. So we're gonna subtract ten from that. So that leaves 527, 66. Get some white out. <clears throat> and that's this week's budget, y'all. That's what we got. This is the slow week. Um, that's why I wanted to take care of some deals this week and get some stuff for the budget bots for like march and april really we're kind of getting stuff for april um for those that have been asking the chapeys are coming back they should be back next week um and yeah also if you're new here we have the budget box which is a monthly subscription box curated with all the budget items that you need and some extras and um we have openings for the budget box for february and we do three months you can pay i think it's 94 dollars for three months or 91 and then a one-time payment is 45 and a monthly fee if you just subscribe monthly is 35. the prices will be going up towards the end of the year if not the summer so now's the time to get on board because those who have been with me they will get that price for right now and new people will be paying more so i highly suggest the budget box you can take a uh, look at some of our reels and see some of the past boxes all that great stuff or check out our website so you guys thank you all so much for watching i hope that you enjoyed today's video and again if this is your first time watching um, please do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell. Leave me a message in the comment section and let me know that you're new here and so that I can welcome you to the cove. All right, you all have a great day. Bye.